This natural site provides a living for some clever boatmen all over the world, from Thailand to Corfu. The Maltese Blue Cave is especially nice, and the small harbor from where the boats are departing is singularly pleasant. Besides the cave, we can also admire two other formations similar to fjords. These are the Weird Babu and the Weird Izuriak. Weird means the same in the Maltese language as Wadi in the Arabic language, namely river valley or channel. The Blue Grotto is a 50-meter-long stalactite cave with some coral, although these are not so colorful as the tropical ones. The most amazing spectacle is in the morning hours, but each part of the day has its specialty. The cliff dropping abruptly to the water is broken by countless caves and hollows. In the distance of six kilometers, we can see the inhabited island of Filfla. The island was used by NATO for a long time, and even nowadays cannot be visited. Close to the Blue Cave, there's a temple group which consists of three individual cultic places that later were surrounded by a common wall. This is an archaic world with a mysterious symbol. It was built three to four thousand years before Christ, and the big question is the same here as with the Egyptian pyramids: How could people move those almost twenty-ton rocks? According to the science findings, those huge stone tables were altars and served for presenting victims. Just like Stonehenge, Higger Quim also provides evidence that the beginning of human civilization is older than we imagine. The nearby Manadra is a similar megalithic church, which has been closed to visitors owing to repeated vandalism.